mental health facilities across the state have recently closed down. Various media reports suggest the tactic removal of federal government funding combined with neglect and abuse to patients are the main causes of the demise of mental health institutions. Let's take a look inside one of these facilities and unravel the lives of staff and inmates alike who are subject to the walls and confines of institutional regulations. We will also meet the Drain Dads and Tofu Range who joined us on a collaborative explore with myself, Heather from Come Heather with Heather and Drew from Drew's Adventures. The links to these amazing explorers and content creators will be posted in the description below. Megan, a non-content creator but really close friend makes a special guest star appearance. This is a section that I haven't seen, guys. Wow. Okay, so this is part two from last week. Um, wow. Check that out. Tell you what guys, I am getting the heebie-jeebies in here. Did you want that light on? Oh, okay. Just a bit more light. Is it turned off again? Oh, hang on. Okay, guys, what have we got in here? Wow, look at all those chairs. Alright. Man, what a waste of government property. Check it out. So I'm here with Drew's Adventures, come Heather with Heather, we've got me and our friend and we're here with the Drain Dads as well. So, um, whoa, kitchen, is this a kitchen? No entry please. What the hell? Oh, shit. This place is 
absolutely massive. Should we yeah. go through the doors, Drew? It feels like it gets bigger and bigger, doesn't it? Oh, you're gonna get, we're going to get lost in this, Paul. It's open. Oh, yes. Doctor's room. Mm. Oh, <laughs> we have a wheelchair. A pretty dirty one. It's in here. out here that's all locked up has us down there all right what do you reckon guys we'll go visit the mortuary Where is everyone? Court assessment, so we're in the court. We're in the courtroom, guys. Wow, look at that! They're still, they're still got stuff in in these drawers.
security monitors. Now, I've just got we just gotta be careful about the security come past here. So we wanna be quick and get as much filming done as we can guys. You know, like my camera light reflecting off those, and I'm thinking, like, is there a light on in here? Because it's actually reflecting off them. Look. Crime remand. Ooh. Well. seen this all of this yeah, thing I don't know how we got in here, I'm lost. We need to find Heather. She's out here in, on her own. <laughs> lost. Lost Heather and trying to dance. <laughs> What's your friend called? Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember this part. Oh shit, look at that. What's that? It's like yeah. been eaten out by termites. Oh, or... And look at the switches though, weren't they? They oh. were used to lock the, they were used to lock the doors, see? Right. Oh, of course. So this is a. This could be a prison. Right. It was used for people that had committed crimes, minor crimes, but under Mental Health Act. Right. So it wasn't like you know. Yeah. Locked them away and whatever. But I think yeah, I think they're down there. Yeah, they are down there. No, that's us. Yeah. No, that's us. Oh, okay. When I thought it was. Shit we do. <laughs> oh. 
the hallway through. When it's in the bathtub, <laughs> the bathtub, the bathtub. <laughs> when it's in the bathtub, the bathtub. He has... Come on, hurry up. <laughs> Guys, um, check it out. I don't know what it is, but it's wicked. So to just quickly go for a walk down this part. This place is huge. It's actually and it's just that is crazy. Crazy one as well. That's weird. That's what I. That's what I did to Drew. Yeah. Slowed it right down.